What are you doing? Going fishing. The river's around here, famous for the smallmouth bass. Fella I met showed me a couple spots. You want to join me? Ah, I can't fish with you. You're far too good. Oh, come on, come on. Hey, join me. I'll show you a couple of my tricks. There's a spot not too far from here that I've been wanting to try out. Glad you're so excited about this. You will be too when you start pulling out smallmouth. Okay, follow me. I thought you said it wasn't far. Too far to walk, though. Yeah, come on. Yep, yeah. Been a while since we rode out, just you and me. Probably since we went looking for John on the mountain. Uh, yeah. Already seems long ago. How you feeling about everything? Been a strange couple of months. Hey, you know, I can't even return to my country because the price on my head is so big. This? This is nothing exactly new to me. And I'll always be loyal to Dutch. He sees the world the same as I do. If we have to fight, we fight. If we have to run, we'll run. If we must die, we'll die, but we'll stay free. And Dutch, you... You don't feel like, well... That he's doing things a little differently now? You saw what happened with that girl on the ferry. No fight, good or bad, is one without blood. I know that better than most. I think too many people are focusing on Dutch when they should be looking at themselves. What they could have done better. Uh, maybe you're right. We'll cut through to the right here. Ha! The other day, I rode down to the Lanahatchee River. I caught some beautiful steelhead trout. You mean the Lanahatchee River? No, 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 no. The, the Lanahatchee. It runs right near here. Yeah, but it's pronounced Lanahatchee. Why is everything in English said differently than it's written? Make us feel stupid? Oh, you're asking the wrong feather. Okay, it's just down the hill here. Arthur! Okay, come on. Let's go try our luck. Pretty country. <sighs> Beautiful. Come on, let's go see what's biting. You take this spot, Arthur. I'm going to cast from over to the right there, so we're not in each other's way. Time of day really can make a difference. They feed early morning or late evening because that's when the insects are more likely to be out. We're 
lucky, got such nice weather. But rain can be good. Sometimes big fish think the raindrops are insects. Well, I guess it's still relaxing even if I don't catch anything. Sort of like staring at the sky. It's your bait, I think. Come use some of mine. Oh, it's not the bait. It's me. I've always been a poor fisherman, especially compared with you and Jose. Just try some of mine. Here. Crickets. Thanks. He's a fighter. Trick is... Let him tire himself out. Look at that. That's a good looking fish. Well done. I was thinking, you remember that stagecoach we held up in Nevada? Yeah. It was a tip from that crooked lawman in Reno. We opened the door and it's full of women and children. Rich, but women and children. So we let it go and read in the newspaper that the O'Driscolls robbed and killed them all the next day, further down the trail. Yep. You know, way back in the day, Home O'Driscoll and Dutch were sort of friends. Friends? Well, not friends, but they had an understanding. Then Combs Main Street got meaner and Dutch... Dutch wanted to try to live a different way. And now, here we are. Okay, let's try for another. There you go, Arthur. He's a fighter. He's small, but might make a nice meal. Lucky. Let's try for one more and then head back. What do you say? That's fine with me. Another one. I heard people talk about a huge smallmouth in Lake Owangila, west of Strawberry, over in Big Valley. You'd need a lure to catch one that big, though. Another one. Another one. This is an angry one. Pull to the left as he goes right. Good job, Arthur. I'm oh, keeping you. Not bad, you see? It's the bait. <laughs> it ain't just the bait. I'm gonna head back. You wanna join me, or uh, you keep trying for these bastards? I'll come. Okay, let's go. Why are you wearing that badge around here? 
I reckon you might be the most loyal of the lot of us. What else is there? Well, you're right about that. All right, Arthur. Hip, hip. <laughs>